seller closing cost calculator is on your mind and it should be since the pandemic the housing market has been insane and more home prices have gone up tremendously in the last six months we closed a total of 2712 properties locally here in staten island alone if you own a house in staten island and you are entertaining the idea of selling your house and moving Closing costs is something you absolutely must consider because seller's closing costs are a big portion of expenses selling real property. I'm Sphere Popolevsky with Supreme Home Sales. Being a local real estate broker here in Staten Island, I love helping you navigate the home selling process. And today's topic is Mango! seller's closing cost calculator and we'll calculate the current closing cost together right after in the last six months that now had 2712 properties in total that closed and sold 676 of those properties has sold under 500,000 and 1842 homes closed and sold between 500,000 and 999,000 dollars the rest sold for 1 million dollars and for those sales the closing costs are even higher because there's a one percent luxury tax for home selling at 1 million dollars plus if you watched my video that i did about closing costs for sellers selling your house in staten island then you already know that if your house is worth under 500,000 or above 500,000, seller's closing costs differ. If you did not watch that video yet, please watch it after this video. Don't stop this one. Getting back to seller's closing cost calculator. If you are selling your house now or going to sell soon, you will most likely find yourself in the 500,000 to $999,000 range, which is approximately 64% of the home sold in the past six months. And this is what your closing costs look like. We will calculate the seller's closing costs for this example at a sale price of $750,000. There's going to be two transfer taxes. One is going to be the New York City at 1.425% and the other one is going to be New York State at 0.4% which gives us a total of $10,688 on this one and $3,000 on this one the New York City transfer tax and the New York State transfer tax are the largest portion of your selling expenses. Don't forget to calculate your seller's attorney that's going to do your contract and handle the closing for you. You can estimate those to be anywhere between $1,200 to even $2,000. Depends where you hire your attorney. There will be also a reporting fee. They would run you somewhere between $250 to $350. And that's your closing costs. In addition to these closing cost expenses, when you sell your house, don't forget to account for paying off your mortgage if you have one and the realtor's fee if you have hired the services of a realtor to sell your house. If you're planning on hiring the services of a realtor to sell your house, I did a video about how to hire a realtor to sell your house on Staten Island. In this video, I give you seven really important questions you absolutely must be asking when you are choosing a real estate agent to sell your house. Make sure to watch this video next. Remember to comment below ask question like this video and consider subscribing let's navigate the home selling process together thank you for watching i promise to see you next monday